Senior Wahine Po Ai Moku Nahale A will offer Olelo Ho'okipa words of welcome. She is the daughter of Nohea Hiva Hiva Stibbert and Kihei Nahale A. Noho Oya Keana O'ahu. Senior Emmy. Kaulana no na pani olo pipi, hie hie mahalu na o kali o, kau e kalei me kahi na kanui, ho ahi hi o e ke i ke. Ai, he ho ahi no ke i ke ke kula na aku pani olo. E ke ana ina kanaka na kini na mamo o ka ina aloha. Mai ki alo o mauna kea a hoe aku i ka unulau o hala li'i ma ni'i hau, velina mai kako me ki aloha. He ahi ahi ho o hano hano kea i ka hoe lina paniolo i awamo ia e na hanauna i noho a kupa ma nei aina kuleiwi o Hawai'i. A he ahi a me he paniolo. He lua ole ka hana o alea. Ali i ka pavo a kalani a komo piha i ka hana nui a kalauna ole. O ka paniolo kai ike i na mea o uka, a me na mea o kai o kona aina pono i hono. He noho aloha aina no ia. Mamuli ho ia ki a mopilina i lilo e ka paniolo i kahu, mai ke la pea ki a pea o ka aina. E like me ka olelo a ke kupa. I paniolo e ka paniolo, i Hawaii e ka Hawaii, i Hawaii e ka paniolo. E lawe mākou, nā pua pōahi, i ka nani ka maha o kona hona paniolo, a malama i loko mākou pākahi a pau. I oi mau ko mākou ola, i hiki ke hapai i ka hai o ka lana kila o ko kākou lāhu i Hawaii. E maliu mai i ka uehea nei, a e nā nea i ke kani mau pua o mākou i ke mele ana i nā mele paniolo i kia ahi ahi. O ka piha makahiki, he o kai handali me e kolu, o ka hoku kuhi meni, o ki kula o ka meha meha ma ka pālama. No leila e nga hoa, e hau hoa e ka lio, e ho o mā kau kau i ko kaula ili, a e ki au like e kākou. Senior Emmy Shigekane will introduce tonight's judges. She is the daughter of Kimberly and James Shigekane. Noho oya ma kailua o ahu. Hui, au hea o ko, in a luna loi loi o kei apo. After months of preparation, we as Halmana are honored to have such a distinguished panel of judges to determine which classes have lassoed wins in tonight's competition. So, without further ado, please allow me to introduce the illustrious men and women that make up tonight's panel of judges. Audience, please hold your applause until all have been introduced. From Heiia O'ahu and a 2001 graduate from Kamehameha School's Kapa'alama, Mrs. Mia Amor Kehaulani Evai Malo Paraka will serve as tonight's first choral judge. Mrs. Paraka received her Bachelor of Music degree in music education and music performance from Chapman University and is formerly the choral director for the Hawaii Youth Opera Chorus, the Kawaiya Ha'o Church Youth Choir, Sacred Hearts Academy, and Kamehameha School's Kapa'alama Kulavaina. A multiple Nahoku Hanohano award winning recording artist and a 1992 alumnus of Kamehameha Schools, Mr. Kalei Stern will serve as tonight's second choral judge. Mr. Stern received his Bachelor of Music degree from the University of Hawaii at Maunoa and is currently the music director for the Calvary Episcopal Church in Kaneohe and a featured vocalist with the Royal Hawaiian Band. Jeremy Kamakane Aloha Hopkins is a proud 1991 graduate from Kamehameha Schools and will serve as tonight's first language judge. He is a multi Nahoku Hanohano award winning recording artist, musician, entertainer, and hakumele. As a beloved Kumu Olalo Hawaii, Mr. Hopkins has taught generations of Haumana at Punanaleo and various universities and schools across the state. A respected Kumu Olalo Hawaii, Hakumele, and award winning musical artist, Ms. Kainani Kahao Naile, will serve as tonight's second language judge. A Kumu at Kahaku Ula Okeelikolani College of Hawaiian Language and Literature, Ms. Kahao Naile has also developed Hawaiian language acquisition and mele curriculum for Punana Leo, and she is a working musician at an advocate for Hawaiian music creation, performance, and consumption for all. 
famed musical arranger and composer of songs and oli, Mr. Louis Moon Kawakahi will serve as tonight's overall judge. As one of the original founding members of the local music group, Makaha Sons of Niihau, Mr. Kawakahi has been an inductee into the Wine Music Hall of Fame and is a Lifetime Achievement Award recipient from the Hawaii Academy of Recording Arts. He currently works as a Youth Development Specialist for the Queen the Uokalani Trust and continues to share history, stories, and mele throughout schools in Na Na Kuli and the Waianae Coast. Ladies and gentlemen, our song contest judges this evening. Nolaila in a homana in a loyal Kamehameha singing. And we'll be kicking off tonight's song contest competition with the young men of Kamehameha singing first when we return. Welcome back to the 103rd Annual Kamehameha School Song Contest. We begin tonight with the men's competition. Presenting Na Kane o Kamehameha is senior Mailani Magbanua. She is the daughter of Momi and Momi and Josh Magbanua. Noho oya ma kailua kona Hawaii. Kakahi akano was heard bright and early as Uncle Sunny Kekelani greeted his men in the old Paniolo way. Ikaika, akamai a onipa'a, strong, skilled, and steadfast. Many famous Kanaka Paniolo, such as Ikua Purdy, Kioni Li'ili'i, Uncle Karen Haleamau, Uncle Kimo Ho'opai, and Uncle Sunny, just to name a few carried themselves with the utmost dignity as they paved the way for future Paniolo in a country unlike anything in the American West. Treacherous A'a and Pahoehoe at their feet, rainforests and cane fields, these classic men embodied strength, determination, and resilience, just as our Kane of Kamehameha strive to do today. This evening, the men of Kamehameha will show their strength and skills, Maona Mele Paniolo, their songs depicting the legacy of the Hawaiian cowboy. Whether they whisk you away to the beautiful slopes of Hualalai or traverse the landscape of Kaleponi and the Golden Gate Bridge, saddle up and listen as they compete with their voices and rope our hearts with their mele. E olu olu, may I have the order please? The sophomore men will sing about the famous Kioni Li'ili'i. Second. The junior men will saddle up and take us on a ride to San Francisco. First. And lastly, the senior men will carry us to the beautiful slopes of Hualalai, third. Now, let now Kane O Kamehameha grab the reins from those who have rode before us, and may the legacy and skill of the Paniolo continue for generations to come. E Paniolo Mo. Jason Shears will introduce the junior men. He is the son of Norlin Badua and Kenneth Cheers. Noho oya ma alia manu ahu. Ehu, ka hea maila na kane o ka papa o ma o ma o ina leo hano hano o roselani ya o lehua. Listen, as our junior men call upon our trusty steeds, Roselani and Lehua, as they lead us to victory in our mele composed by famed musician and entertainer, Solomon K. Bright. In 1933, while performing in San Francisco, Uncle Saul, as he is affectionately called, noticed a young woman doling out money any time a musician would yodel. Well, 
Uncle Saul seized the opportunity and yodeled out what would then become the famed melee, Hawaiian Cowboy. So tonight, now Kane Uncle Papa Oma Oma O. Under the direction of Logan Ledesma and arranged by Timothy Kelly Ho, will serenade you with our rendition of this esteemed melee. And ladies, don't forget, much like our talented, beloved, and ingenious Uncle Saul, our virtual tip jar is still open. <laughs> we accept Cash App, PayPal, Zelle, Stripe, Venmo, and Apple Pay. Aloha, Ika Hawaiian Cowboy. Ledesma will direct the junior men. He is the son of Erica and Stuart Ledesma. Noho oya ma pu'uloa o ahu. I decided to choose this song because I thought it really represented our boy, the boys of our class because it's very energetic and during rehearsal I see a lot of that in them. Oh, oh, yeah, oh, 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 oh
And we'd like to say aloha to Tim Ho and also to Michael and Kaipo. Joshua Dwayne Figueroa will introduce the sophomore men. He is the son of Tamlin and Dwayne Figueroa. Noho oya ma kapo le o ahu. Kolana Kainoa o John Koana na Koa Lindsay Jr. The mele Hano Hano Valeno na Cowboy, originally composed by Sam Kamai Pelikane, talks about the world renowned Waimea Cowboys of Parker Ranch in the uplands of Hawaii Island. These Paniola were known by many as being the most skilled at roping wild cattle with their lasso. This mele pays tribute to longtime Paniola foreman John Keoni Li'i Li'i Koana na Koa Lindsay Jr. Arranged by Zachary Alaka Ilam and under the direction of Emi Ole Sabian Ohai, let na kane o kapapa pony take you on a journey, Iuko o Mona Kea, with our mele, Hano Hano Vale no na cowboy. Emi Ole Ohai will direct the sophomore men in his first year as a song contest director. Emi Ole is the son of Kalei and David Ohai, noho oya ma ahui manu o ahu. The best thing about being a director is being able to hear our class come together and see the final product of our song and how special it really is. Oh, oh, oh. 
I thought their interpretation was really, really maika'i as far as how they developed the song and the wording of their mele. Jarrett Love Tabion will introduce the senior men. He's the son of Heather Love Tabion and Sid Tabion. Noho oya makunia o ahu. My nakula meka leo puakea e haa ana. I kia ni pea hi lau o kaniu. Mai ka i hue hue e vai honeu. I ke ya ahi ahi e hua ka i kako i kona. Mau ka mako mele o hue hue. Ua haku ia e Rose Simerson. A ua ho anoho noho ia e Justin Kaupu. He mele ke ia e piliani i kahi hanai pipi o hue hue. Nā ko ahana Stillman. Vahia a ka haku mele. Nani no o hue hue. E ia na e. Ho o kahi no hewa, he ulua ole. Ah, e nana mai, nui na ulua e noho nei moho pe oku. Me kama ko paniolo nui o ke ahe o lau ni u Lopez. E holo ana nga kane. I kahi ko ia me nga lei mele mele i keia hua ka i i. Hue, hue. Neil Lopez will direct the senior men in his second year as a song director. He is the son of Tevairangi Worthington Lopez and Pono Lopez. Noho oya makapa lamo ahu. Our men's song this year is Hu'e Hu'e, and the reason why I chose it is because it has a nice melody, and some of the lyrics that are in that song really connected to me and my childhood. <laughs> experience of four years of singing at song contests, oh, didn't they? Absolutely, and I think what was really special is each class, each class had their own dynamic elements that was special to both, to all of them. Mahalo Nui. And tonight's competition will continue with the young women of Kamehameha singing next when we return. Yeah, that was so much Yo, 
Aloha and welcome back to the 103rd Annual Kamehameha School Song Contest. The women's competition is about to begin. Senior Mason Shane Hanavahine will present Nawahine o Kamehameha. He is the son of Uilani and Newton Hanavahine, Nohooya Makapolei Oahu. Velina Maye na Kupuna, na Makua, na Opio, Ame na Pua Hoio Ko Hawaii Ipai Aina, Kawahi Ki Kumukai, Ai Kamole Olu, Olehua, Ano Ai Mekia Loha Ya Kako Wa Paulo. Good evening, Kamehameha, but more importantly, good evening, ladies. Tonight, Navahine o Kamehameha. Through the expressions of the memorable Paniolo and Mele, shall captivate our minds and hearts as they take us back in time. From a moment when a young man is courting a beloved in Kealo Okorose, from a moment when a young, when a young man discovers the one he adores has found a new love in Hane Sakalo, and finally to that moment where you follow your heart's desire, endlessly pursuing a fate that may never come to pass, in Adios Kealoha. May these talented young women in both celebration and gratitude allow us to witness these significant moments in time. In commemorating this 103rd song contest, let Navahine o Kamehameha serenade us with the leo nahe nahe, paying homage to the hard work, tradition, and legacy of the famed Paniolo. E olu olu, may I have the order. Navahine o Kapapoponi will reveal the sweet fragrance of a blossoming rose in Kealo o Karose last. <laughs> Navahine o Kapapo o Mao Mao will recount the risk love must endure in Hane Sakala first. And finally, Navahine o Kapapa Mele Mele was singing about the return of an empty-handed lover in Adios Kealoha second. So saddle up and hold on to your reins as our Kamehameha call girls take you on a ride through the Paniolo country. Ria! Hashimoto and Noah Morse. Noho Oya, Makane Oheo Ahu. He ho heno kiyo no kahane sakala. Ke alamo ho ia uhi i honiye. In this heart-wrenching love song, composer Thomas Lindsay keenly depicts the love that he had for a beautiful woman. He often gifted her with fragrant lei of honeysuckle blossoms, which he would pick as he rode through the uplands of Kauai Hai on his way to Kohala. On his last trip, he realized his love and admiration were not being reciprocated. In fact, he was being betrayed. That day, he left a wilted honeysuckle lei at her doorstep and rode away. Heartbroken and tormented. I left my lei already wilted because a worthless person had already come to steal your heart from me. Listen to the Manu Leo Nahe Nahe O Ola'a as the junior women share their Hanesakala. Directing the junior women is Sela Franda. She is the daughter of Karen Kaupu and Roderick Franda. This year's theme is special because we were able to go to Waimea and I saw the people that 
these Paniolo are and the values that they hold, they are what embody a Hawaiian. the junior women did an amazing job showing the softer side of a rugged cowboy. He really left his heart on his sleeve and oh, the heartbreak and the lay. What a beautiful interpretation of that arrangement. Beautiful. My Bo Sousa and of course, that beautiful leader. 
Noelle Amuk Sang will introduce the senior women. She is the daughter of Michelle and Bradley Amuk Sang. Noho oia ma kailua o ahu. Invited by Kauike Oli in the 1830s, the vaqueros ventured to our shores and taught our ancestors more than how to herd cattle. In the midst of the ranches, our ingenious kupuna not only learned the vaqueros' work, but also their traditions. Paired with our ancestors' appreciation for the aina, the vaqueros' presence led to Hawaii's very own paniolo lifestyle. Becoming a staple of many towns, the Paniolo influence reached the pastures of our Ali'i. The talented Prince William Pitt Leleo Hoku wrote Adios Ke Aloha, weaving the language from our friendly vaqueros with the Lele Hawai'i. As we gather on this pole, la'i la'i, we are reminded of the beauty of our aina, the creation of our beloved Paniolo culture, and especially the integrations and influences from the vaqueros. Arranged by Bailey Matsuda and under the direction of Faith Kavai, the senior women would like to extend one last adios ke aloha to all of you. E ku'u bele o kopo la ilai, a hea oi e ho'olono mai. Faith Kavai will direct the senior women for her second year as a song contest director. She is the daughter of Kelehua and Ka'ala Kavai. Noho oya ma kane oheo ahu. Prince Leleo Hoku was influenced by the Mexican vaqueros who came to Waimea to control the surplus of cattle, and he kind of recognized their ingenuity and the influence of their music, language, and culture within Hawaii. Um, and Adios Ke Aloha is kind of an ode to all of that.
what an incredible performance. Understanding the olelo and making that happen through their their huanoho, their notes and their melody. Awesome. Very beautiful. I loved how this took us back to those roots where the Hawaiian cowboys learned from the Mexican cowboys oh. and the traditions really started to blend. Absolutely, absolutely. Kira Tai Hook will introduce the sophomore women. She is the daughter of Amber and James Tai Hook. Noho Oya Mahaula Oahu. He mele aloha makamai ke ia, i haku ia e Daniel Kalia Kaopio, a ho o noho noho ia e Zachary Alaka Ilam. He paniolo o Dani noha pu uhaleni ihau. I kona va o pio ua kupu ia kona aloha, a ulu i loke nani, me ke alo o nauna no kaloke makamai. Me ia aloha, i haku ai ke mele o ke ala o karose. He leo ho ohano hano keia i ke aloha e liliko nei no korose nani lua ole. Ha ahe o no na uivio ni i hau a pulama mau i keia mele. No laila, e na uivi mai o a o e valea mai i na leo mo kuhi kuhi o na wahine o ka papa poni. Ala ka i ia e fe pua le hua o ka i po le manu a kiko masatsuka nu hiva. Fane Uhiva will direct the sophomore women. She is the daughter of Yoko and Derek de Uhiva. Noho oia ma wai anai o ahu. I chose this mele because not only is it a common song, but it's an easy song to relate to. This song talks about a high school love story between a cowboy and a girl, and her name is Rose. Oh uh... 
That was so beautiful. And I think um, this is the best when they can actually understand what the melee are about and the interpretations that they're doing through through the um, comp not only the composition but the arrangers as well. Beautiful job, mahalo. I, I think it's their ability to relay that message to to you know, to the wahine and make it apuho, something that they can grasp and understand. Especially nowadays, you know, when you're talking about older melee, how do you make it relate? Beautiful song of Mi'iho. Well, coming up next, all four classes will compete in the co-ed competition at the 103rd Annual Kamehameha School Song Contest after this. Aloha and welcome back. We're here live at the 103rd Annual Kamehameha School Song Contest. It's time for tonight's final competition, the co-ed contest. Freshman Hanamua Gursava will introduce the four classes. She is the daughter of Makano Nalani and Likeke Gursava. Noho oia ma waima nalo o ahu. O kaka ko haavina haia o. Loa no makupuke o galatia mo kuna eo no pauku e hiku. Pene i palapala iai. O ka ke kanaka i lulu. O ka na ho ia e ohimai. Mau popo ke ia haavina i na paniolo. Ai ke ia hiahi e ho o hano hano ana mako. I koka paniolo ala kai mana opaa no eo a ho owe kaika ma loko ona kane. Amena vahine paahana o ka meha meha. Elike me na paniolo, na na elulu i keia mo mele, no ko ho okuku mele huipu ia i keia po, no ko ohi anaina po mai kai. E hi meni ana ka papa umikuma lua i ke mele o kaula ili. Ua ho noho noho ia e bo suza a la kai ia e mai ka ke kaula. This mele takes us to Mauna Kea and talks about the hardships that come with gathering cattle. The rocky terrain makes riding for the paniolo difficult. Nonetheless, they don't give up, reminding us, naka naka, to always persevere. Ehi meniana, ka papa mekale o ma o ma o ike mele o kila kila na rough rider. Wa ho no ho no ho ia, ke ia mele, e tai sama sama ka imina o wo e tuati. Alla ka ia e tai tia sinaoka. Famous are ikuwa, ka oa, and lo the spirited Hawaiian cowboys of the early 1900s. Inducted into the Rodeo Hall of Fame, they proudly carried the banner of victory as champions at the world-famous Cheyenne Rodeo in 1908. These rough riders proudly celebrated are the glory of Hawaii. Ua haku ia ke mele o mai kai wai mea e Reverend John Kalino. Na Billy Matsuda i ho'onoho noho i keia mele, ayala kaiana o Lauren Kawai i ka papa mekale pony. Rich in Paniola history, Waimea is well known for its cowboy culture. The beauty of Waimea is a majestic comfort to behold, and presence is the warmth of the people's love for one another and their aina. He mele no mai kai Waimea. O kupa landing hano hano wikamaka. Ehi meni yana ka papa mekale ula ula i neia mele ho eu eu na la kaue i haku. Ua ho'onoho noho o Zachary Lum i keia mele. Na Brennan Akioli e ala kai yana i ka papa eva. Named after Henry Cooper, Cooper Landing was a pier used for the steamships that once visited Ho'okena, exchanging goods and shipping cattle into this once bustling town. This mele is a popular yodeling song amongst Ipaniolo. Eia kamanawa a ka koui kaliai, e olu olu, e ha avi mai i ka papa kaina. May I have the order, please? Persevering through the rocky terrain of Mauna Kea, the senior class will sing third. The proud Rough Riders 
adorned with green lei will sing first. <laughs> Walking through Waimea's chilly Kee Pu'upu'u rain, the sophomore class will sing last. Yodeling from the Purin Ho'okena, proudly wearing red, the freshman class will sing second. Eo mai na paniolo, no noe lei ha'aheo. Taitea Sunaoka will direct the junior class. He is the son of Vaihere Temanaha and Kai Sunaoka. Noho oya ma kane ohe o ahu. Here the biggest values I've learned since I've gotten here is ho'omau, which is to per persevere through any challenges, aloha, which is showing love to others, and malama to take care of not only others but the land as well.
The junior co-ed, they really captured that spirit of Waimea. You can see the wahine with their titoban. <laughs> <laughs> they worked really hard on that one from the, even yesterday. Yeah, and the blend of the voices, the men and the women together, you can feel their energy tonight. Yeah. Really, really great improvement on what they did from before. Awesome. Brendan Akowili will direct the class of 2026 in their song contest debut. Brennan is the song of Robin and Lionel Akowili no Ho'oya Ma Kailua O'ahu. I would say what attracted me to the song was that it talked about home, you know, that place that you long to be. And I th feel like a lot of people will connect to that.
Welcome to the oh. welcome to the contest, welcome freshman Papa Ava. You know, sometimes there's just melee that are written for specific classes, especially playful ones like this. Perfect for the freshman class. They really brought the yodeling to life. So the quick transitions between the high notes and the low notes. Mahalo, may kailua. Maika Kekaula will direct the senior class. He is the son of Shante and Po Maika I Kekaula. Noho oia ma kahalu'u o ahu. The mele has a specific part of the song. It says, Oh, never mind, Kehino Pu Ikino, which talks about um, enduring and even if you fall off your horse, you have to get back up and keep going.
What a beautiful way to end their last song contest. And look at the aloha and the respect, the whole ihi, that their fellow classmates, fellow, are sharing. Lauren Kavai will direct the sophomore class. She is the daughter of Juliana and Eric Kavai. Noho oya ma pauau ahu. I hope you'll be able to hear the warmth of our class as we sing my ka'i mea as it connects to the paniolo ohana and the warmth that they share within.
Oh, my Kai. You know, off camera, we were talking about how these beautiful songs, we just start swing, and then you hear the calling out. Tell us more about that. Oh, that's wonderful. You know, it was specifically put in there uh, at the request of, you know, what they learned about all the different pu'u that worked around all these paniolo. So what a means to ho'ohano hano, to glorify these, these paniolo that worked there, you know, calling out all the pu'u that they recognize, that they work with daily. Beautiful, beautiful. Yes. From the mele to the alaka'i to the mea ho'onohonoho. <sighs> yes, right on. You know what was really amazing is that I thought the juniors did an excellent job. I mean, there was solos, and you could really feel the intensity and the levels in their differing music, didn't they? You know, and they, they really don't have a choice on who arranges their mele. So really, each class had to take it on to themselves to really make it special to what's special to their class. And then it's that through that interpretation that they bring it out and they present it to the audience tonight. What a wonderful job to all classes. Yes, mahalo nui. Mahalo. And coming up next, we'll be hearing Manao from some special guests right after this. Aloha and welcome back. Oh, we apologize for some of the technical difficulties, but we are back. All of the classes have presented their mele for the song contest competition. But first, there's one major performance still left, and that is the tradition of Ho'ike. First, let's take a look at the inspiration behind tonight's Ho'ike. For over 175 years, the grit and grace of rugged Hawaiian cowboys skillfully roping and driving cattle from dawn to dusk have been the stuff of legend. Stealing the breath of American cowboys and some 12,000 rodeo fans, three extraordinary paniolo from Waimea seized first, third, and sixth place at the Frontier Days World Champion Roping Competition in Cheyenne, Wyoming in 1908. The remarkable landscapes that inspire our heroic men on horseback, driving cattle, and hauling cane are captured in nostalgic songs from the heart of the Paniolo. A hard day's work might lead to an evening of rich, playful music making. Dapper Paniolo with lay around their papale might serenade a sweetheart in the moonlight or pine away on her doorstep over unrequited love. Tonight, in honor of this beloved time-honored legacy, we dedicate Ho'ike to the Paniolo families and communities throughout Hawaii where horsemanship thrives and roping, rodeo, and ranching culture is vibrant. Ho'ike 2023, Aloha Ika Hawaiian Cowboy. Welcome back. Just before Ho'ike na haumana o Kamehameha Kapal Lama will unite their voices to sing two school songs. Both composed by Kamehameha graduate Charles E. King. Senior Keola Mauloa Pilayo will lead Inua Kamehameha and Senior Milan Plunkett will lead Kamehameha Waltz.
Cut ye. While the judges' scores are being tallied, we're lucky to experience the highly anticipated tradition of Ho Ike, showcasing student performances of hula, mele, and oli. I'm certainly when I'm certain that we are in for a lively performance tonight as Ho Ike takes us on a magical ride celebrating the best of Paniolo culture.
their hospitality, Robert Hind and his wife Hannah received many visitors at Poo Va Va Ranch in North Kona. George Cook of Molokai Ranch is called Paniolo Nui, Boss Cowboy, in a song written in his honor.
Dapper Poniolo with Lei around their paw pale might serenade a sweetheart in the moonlight or pine away on her doorstep over unrequited love. From Pu'u Kanaka Leo Nui on Mauna Kea to the rolling hills of Pu'u Anahulu to the rocky Kohala coastline at Upolu and throughout our Pai Aina. The rich stories of Poniolo life are captured in our mele. Oh, oh. 
Capewright composed Hawaiian Cowboy on the spot at a show in San Francisco in response to a page's request for cowboy yodeling songs. This Hawaiian classic became his signature song for some 60 years. Uncle Saul was inspired by his relative, the famous Ikua Purdy, who won first place in the World Roping Championship in Wyoming in 1908. A proud Rough Rider from Waimea, Aloha Ika Hawaiian Cowboy. Here is Kamahao Hamea Thronas.
Michael Thomas Capelle and Leo Cooper. Soloist, Paul Michael, Wally Daniels, and Kamahao Romeo Torres. Our party on the road, Leo, Siano, Kilinahe, and Carly. And the Kamehameha School's Concert Glee Musical Ensemble, and yours truly, Makes you want to go jump on that horse, <laughs> Kayla, and I go, Holy no, oh, no. Wow. What a whole Ikea performance. Yes. All done by students. Wonderful. Yeah. The importance right. of right. knowing and understanding Olelo Hawaii and bringing that interpretation to the audience. What a wonderful job. Hui, and naho Olelo Hawaii, pehemene olua. Aloha. Oh, my kaivale no ma. Heha ko olua mana o ia ho Ikea meka ho okuku mele. Oh, he nani no, ua kau koke na maka i na lole ana paniolo, a ua la lau i ana pepeao e na puukani. Oh, yeah. 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 And now we begin the presentation of awards at the 103rd Annual Kamehameha School Song Contest. Senior Chanel Matsumoto will introduce tonight's award presenters. She is the daughter of Angela Matsumoto and Eric Matsumoto. Noho Oya Ma Evo Ahu. What a fun night full of beautiful melee. And with that, it's time to close this rodeo down and lasso in awards to present to these haumana. Much like the hardworking Paniolo, whose days are filled with excitement, hard work, and much aloha for each other, the haumana have given it their all tonight. We've reached the point in tonight's program to find out which classes have roped in the victory. Named after a graduate of the first class of the School for Girls in 1897, the Louisa Oy McGregor Award recognizes the student director who has dedicated the most to the class in terms of organizational ability, leadership, assistance to others, and persistence. Here presenting tonight's award is the great-granddaughter of Louisa Oy McGregor, Dr. Rosie Allegado. Aloha ahi ahi kako. Mai ka ohana o Louise Aoi Wang Kong McGregor. He pa'i a pa'i ke ia po. O ka mea lana ki la mua. O Brennan a ka ouli. What a, what a great congratulatory victory for the freshmen and their, soft, uh, and their leader, Brennan Akoili. With his rendition of Koopa Landing, arranged by Zach. O Kamea Lanakila, Taitea Sunaoka. They really brought the house down with all of their melodic voices and such energy tonight. They really brought it. Oh, yes, they did. With Kila Kila Na Rough Riders. <laughs> Rough Riders. <laughs> uh -huh. 
The Richard Lyman Jr. Olalo Mokuahine Award recognizes a group that demonstrates excellent puana of our Olalo Mokuahine. One of the most fundamental parts of a culture is its language, and arguably, there is no bigger kuleana than perpetuating the language of one's culture. Richard Lyman Jr., a former trustee of Kamehameha for 30 years, was invested in exactly that, the preservation of Alalo Hawaii and Hawaiian culture. Here presenting tonight's award is the Po'okula of Kula Kie and our school Kamehameha, Taryn Chun. Kanikeo me kahulo he nui. Hu kahaaheo kalahui Hawaii. Keola ne na mele paliolo. Iloko na kane amena wahine o kamehameha. Keola ne kaolelo makuahine. Iloko o kamako mauhamana. Eola mau kaolelo Hawaii. No laila. E ya ae na maho e lei ana i kalana kila o ka papa Richard Lyman o Pio. O ya hoi na kane a me na wahine o ka papa mele mele. Oh, they worked so hard on that. You know, working there Olalo Hawaii was always a tough, tough competition now that Olalo has been really normalized amongst the Hawaiian. Ho'o mai ka'i, ya mai ka ke kauna, a me kona papa, o kauna ili ke mele, a na bo suza i ho'o noho noho. Ho'o mai ka'i a o ko, e ho'o eola mau ka o lelo Hawaii. And you can tell, and you two know, the students work very hard on their diction, right? <laughs> the George Allenson Andrews Cup was first presented in 1921 by a former director of music for the Kamehameha School for Boys, whose life inspired the idea of an annual song contest. This award will be given to the men who have successfully captured the hearts of our judges this evening. Here presenting tonight's award is the Nu'ukumu, the assistant principal of grades 9 and 10, Mr. Kaipo Simpson. Aloha mai kākou, ua lana kila nā kāne o ka papa, mele mele. And the senior man. Oh, wonderful. You know, they worked hard on that. And again, it shows the maturity and their ability to bring it up when it's counted. And that's Keahe Olau Niu Lopez and his class with Hu'e Hu'e, arranged by Justin Ka'uku. Everyone's so appreciative to the seniors, giving them a standing ovation tonight. A visit to the islands from Watertown, Connecticut, Mrs. E.G. Scoville fell in love with the voices of the men and women whom she heard singing. This cup will be given to the women who have successfully saddled the hearts of our judges this evening. Here presenting tonight's award is the Dean of 12th grade, Miss Cheryl Yamamoto. Mahalo ladies for your leo nahe nahe and your beautiful music tonight. Ho'o mai ka'i i ka papa o ma o ma o. Brought out to their mele and their olalo, wonderful. They really, really worked hard. And the junior women really told the story so well of the love and the heartbreak of this Paniolo. Oh, <laughs> oh such love.
Helen Deshaye Beamer was a prolific user of Hawaiian language and her contributions to Hawaiian music are still a big part of our ballet today. This award was donated from the Kamehameha Schools Alumni Association and is awarded to the men, the women, or an entire class with the best musical performance. Here presenting tonight's award are Spencer Wong from the class of 1990 and Beth Miley Wong from the class of 1992, the presidents of the Kamehameha Schools Alumni Association, North Hawaii. As alumni, it is amazing to be back in this arena. And as parents, this is extra special for us tonight because we got to watch our daughter sing in her first song contest. Yeah. This place really brings back very cherished memories uh, associated and rooted with this very special tradition. How about you? I mean, I just remember being here and like waiting for the speakers to hurry up and tell us who won. <laughs> okay, okay, got it. Let's get this moving. On behalf of the Kamehameha Schools Alumni Association, we are very honored to present the Helen Deshay Beamer Award to the Papa wearing lay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This is. We from Waimea, so I feel like we should present with a bandana to the Papa. Oh. You can really feel that they brought Waimea to Honolulu tonight. <laughs> yes. Junior co -ed. Last but not least, this rodeo would not be complete without the most coveted award of the evening, the Charles E. King Award. Charles E. King was an 1891 graduate of the Kamehameha School for Boys and possessed many talents in band leading, composing melee, and publishing. This award is given to the best performance in the co-ed competition. Here presenting tonight's award is the Po'okumu of Kula Kie Kie, Miss Wendy Erskine. Aloha ahiahi kako. The Charles E. King Cup goes to Ho'omaika'i Kapapa o Oma'oma'o. You know, they worked really, really hard, and you can tell from the very beginning, you know, it was a struggle. But you know, they persevered. They worked through their melee, they worked through their ho'onoho, their arrangements, and now, here is the end result. Eka ho'pena, kaleo kalanakila. Mahalo. An amazing night for the juniors. I think it helped them so much that three of their leaders really went to Waimea. I keep saying that. But they got to feel yes. modern Paniolo and their ways. They saw the horses, they saw the cattle, and it just brought the feeling and the spirit, and that's what it's all about tonight. Pololei, pololei. Uh, oh, yeah. Mahalo for joining us tonight. I'm Mahia Lani Richardson for Lili Noe Ka'ahanui, Mele Lani Peng, Kalehua Kava'a, and Hoku Kame'e Aina. I'm, thank you so much for joining us on another amazing tradition of Kamehameha School Song Contest.